one day, a friend of mine was about to head to a bridal shower as a maid of honor. She asked me if I had a stapler. I practically laughed in her face because I knew what she was getting at. Instead, I handed her this. Meet Bouquet. It is the best alternative to making a bouquet out of ribbons on a paper plate. It's so innovative and so easy to use that even I can't mess it up. And let me tell you, I mess up everything. It's a game changer for bridal showers. Because the second best part of opening up gifts and finding out you got a brand new espresso maker is making a keepsake item out of all the bows and ribbons that your friends got you. At any bridal shower, you're gonna have a collection of different types of bows and ribbons. You may also have some of these curly things that nobody ever knows what to do with. So no matter what kinds of bows and ribbons you have, the good news is they all fit beautifully into a bouquet. Are you ready to learn some fun ways to use this? Let's do it. Take the bouquet in one hand and a ribbon in the other and you start by taking the ends of the ribbon and threading it through two holes. I recommend that you start on the outer edge and go in from there. Once they're in the hole, you can tie the bottom and let it hang for now. The fun thing you can do is get different bows and ribbons that are the same color of the bride's wedding color so that this is something that can go with the theme of her wedding and even be displayed at her venue. All different types of bows, some are bigger than others, and you just place the ends through the hole and pull straight through. Those are ribbons that are a little bit longer. What you can do is thread them through this center. Pull it through the center and pull it straight through. Some bows and ribbons might even come with wire on them. So you can take that wire and just like we were doing before, you put one end of the wire through one hole and pull it through. And then on the bottom, you can just tie a knot. Probably do this entire thing in just a couple of minutes. Now one of the things you can do with these curly cues is take the paper side and stick it in underneath the bouquet and simply just pull it straight through. What this is going to do is help hide some of those ribbons at the bottom and give it a fun look underneath your bouquet. What you might want to add to your bouquet are some jewels. A lot of different wrapping and gifts you're going to get are going to have some fun accessories on them. Why not add them into your bouquet? Insert them into the holes where the bows already are and pull them straight through, giving a hint and a pop of different accessories all over your bouquet. Ta-da! It's that simple! And look at what the final product is. And that's the beauty of bouquet. Look at how beautiful this is with all of your bows, all of your ribbons, and some different kinds of jewels looped into a wonderful bouquet that you can now have and hold and keep forever! Go get yourself a bouquet today. Check out bouquet.com and you can have one for your next wedding. Bye!